Well, 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 look what the boots trudged in. We've got some more dust on our plate today. What's up, guys, and welcome back to the Dust Bowl. Welcome back to Gas Station Simulator. That's right, man. I love this game. I have missed this game, and today we are going to be checking out the brand new DLC. Look at the timing here that has to do with airplanes. I think we're opening up an airstrip here at our gas station so you guys know we, we currently have a close I, just, I didn't want all the distractions we've had this gas station for uh the past like year and a half or so it's been fantastic a lot of uh changes happened throughout the years we also got this um you know maintenance thing i think there was a dlc for a car wash this is a car wash that we could potentially restore but we never really did that um we're, we're gonna pretend like we didn't not do it um you know maybe maybe if we decide we like this airplane dlc we might be able to hop back to it but um here we have a new airstrip dlc i think it's here pop it a beer oh gosh it's almost like our our work was almost done it's almost complete could almost sit back, relax, and enjoy our life. This is Fox 29. I've been hit. I require an emergency landing permit. Is anyone there for God's sake? Mayday! Mayday! Ah, uh, damn it! This crap doesn't work. You're just gonna have to put her down, bud. That looked like a pretty bad angle of attack right there. I, uh, I don't know about that one. <laughs> Just as we were starting to chill, enjoy our hard work, business had kind of built its... Oh, oh, hey, hey, what's going on, man? Hey, are you okay? Oh, this, this is... I hate this guy. I hate... No, 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 no. I forget how to get rid of him. How do I get rid of you? Go, go, no, no, please, you suck, Th thanks dude, okay, let's, let's go, I'm, I'm gonna turn him off, vandalizing the walls, yeah, don't, don't mess with my walls, bro, I, I worked too hard for this, and honestly, I, I, I'm an old man at this point, I don't wanna worry about the gas, I wanna worry about our new business venture here, and let's go see, oh, he landed out here, you can see the smoke, alright, so we, we're crossing the street, we've never crossed the street before, this is our new, uh, our new, Hanger, I guess you could call it. Doesn't really look like much yet, but we're going to be improving it over time. Looks like we got a lot of sand we could be moving. You guys know we've got that bobcat. Haven't used that in a hot minute. Hopefully this man's okay. Oh, looks like he survived. He was able to get it down. Hey, come over here. Don't you see I need some help? I see you. How, how you doing? Kowalski, U.S. Air Force Second Lieutenant. And who are you, Private? I know this place, but I don't know you. Well, I own the, the, mute. the I own the thing across the street. This is gonna be a nightmare. Is this station yours? What a mess you've got here. Oh come on, man! Time to take care of this old airstrip. After that, I might introduce you to some business. Perfect. But first, show me what you're made of. Go you want me to check that barn? Check the barn, okay? I'm sure old Toei is still there, and I'll need help from the both of you. Old Toei. Yes, sorry. Good luck. We're going to have some sort of like a, uh, a what's it called? Like a, a, I don't even know what they call like the pushback things? Or like some maybe some sort of a tractor. Be able to tow this plane into the garage. Dude, look at this. I'm so excited. This is such a good game. Like, I, it, I this is one of my favorite games we've ever played, without a doubt. We are going to have to uh, get rid of all this stuff. Do we have a dumpster over here? We do. I remember tossing things in there. Beautiful. Got achievements now. Didn't have those before. See, oh, okay. Threw that out in the interstate. That's probably not our best idea. Let's just at least get it over near the thing, and then we can... Oh. How do we get rid of the cobwebs? Maybe a broom? Got him. Yeah, if we just throw things over in the general vicinity, we should be able to get this place cleaned up real quick-like. They come every day, right? I'm pretty sure. All right, got all this in there. Um, we do have the gas station closed. Technically, we could open it 
and then we could, you know, well, maybe, maybe what we do, I actually have an idea. Let's at least try to keep the money rolling in a little bit. So we're going to go, uh, employees. How do you hire somebody? I forget man management. Let's, let's turn all of this. We're not going to sell anything inside. We're not going to do anything. We're just going to have pump three on, and then we can open this up. And that way it doesn't have the, the thing on there. How do you hire people? Oh, higher right here. Okay, Matthew, level four fueling, level three. You're hired, Matthew. I'm going to talk to him, give him a task list. He is going to fuel the cars. Okay, so the station's open. We're going to be making very limited money, but uh, that's all right. Just one one pump open. I mean, eventually we might be able to hire a couple of employees. I just, I, I kind of want to let that be and, and focus specifically here. Ooh, look at this. Unlock the barn to use the shortcut. Okay. So we've got, uh... Got, got some more spider webs here. Got them. All right. Got some more wood that we're going to want to get rid of. Get this out here. Get these in the dumpster. I think the dumpster comes once a day, right? It's been a while since we played, but... Dude, it, it feels good to be back. We're going to... A trash bag, right? We could pick some stuff up. All right, here we go. Ah, I forgot about the trash bags, dude. The trash bag is the play, and then it fills up, but you can do it way faster. So this here is, is Toei. Toei driving. To drive Toei, use the WASDA buttons. Use the space button for handbrake. To speed up Toei, use left shift. Right mouse button to cool down the engine. X to switch to magnet mode. And also refuel Toei. He's in jerry can. There's a small fuel filler on his right side. All right, let's go, Toei. Let's get the heck out of here. Watch out for the doors and everything else in the way. And uh, here we go. So we want to make sure that we're not overheating his engine. Making sure we're being efficient. And let's get over here and see if we can use the magnet on this plane. Be able to tow her into the barn. Okay, what do we got going on? We'll need that old fella to drag my plane to the barn. Hope you know how to use it. I think so. I mean, we, we could try. So if we X to magnet mode, use Waza to move around the magnet arm, use unbound and E buttons to extend and retract the arm. We might have to find something to that. LMB and right MB, lower and pull up the magnet, use space to activate it. Wow. Okay, there's 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 a lot of a lot of things here. Okay, this is a little bit awkward. We're gonna want to put it on top. Okay. E to extend it. Hmm. It's not letting us extend. Move arm forward. I mean, if if E is if E is forward, should we do D? D would backward be backwards. I mean, I I think that's gonna be okay. Just kidding. I think R works a, a little bit better, so we can extend it out. Oh shoot! I think we're we're gonna have to back up a little bit closer. Don't want to run into the plane, but we're going to have to be able to grab it. So if we bring him here, drop it down, activate. Oh, yeah. I see some indication of a plane here. I think we're about to achieve something great, friendo. Ready to put your back into it? I'm ready to make some money, baby. That's all I'm about. I got, I got $1,100 in my bank account, sir. I'm trying to uh, make as much as I can. We're going to tow Joe's plane to the highlighted spot near the barn. Turn green once you're able to detach the plane. Ooh, we can't still go into overdrive. Obviously, we've got precious cargo here, so we don't want to do too much. But it looks like we might want to back this thing in. Come around this way. Back her up. And when it turns green, we should be good. So if we do that, nice drop work. it. Now, time to fix my plane's wings somehow. Hmm, your shells are empty. Well, help us out with I that, sir. Idea. I've got a small stash of duct tapes. We'll use those. But maybe a younger pair of eyes would do better. Try to cover as many holes as you can. It's pretty easy. You want me to fix your plane wing with duct tape as you sit there. Pick up the duct tape, select left shift button to highlight the holes in the wings. Use LMB on the surface of the wing, start stretching it, cut the tape, LMB again. Now, if the holes cover the outline, around it will turn green and disappear. Okay, so, so we, looks like we got two spots over here, and we are just going to come across like that. Hole's been fixed. 
Hole's been fixed. Anything else? Looks like we got some stuff back here. Might be able to come across this way. I mean, duct tape fixes everything, baby. Hole fixed. This one will probably take two. You know, if this is the quality of, of work and craftsmanship you can expect from us and our, our plane business, I, I don't know if I would bring my plane here, but I guess to each their own. I'm going to do like an X usually improves uh, stability, right? All right. You finished? Hmm. Not great. Not terrible. <laughs> but it looks like you're not a useless loafer after all. Well, thanks. Hmm. I could use a runway to take off, friend out. Can you make it work? Oh, and boy. And relax. You're not doing it for free. So we're going to have to clear out a runway, aren't we? I'm going to reset Toei. It's going to put him back in there. The sun's going down. So we want to go back to the, the PC and we're going to want to buy the airstrip. This person's been sitting over at the uh, the gas station for a while. So we can do this for old time's sake. I missed this game, dude. This really was so much fun. Have a good one, man. We hired somebody and they just straight up never came, huh? Brother, please come fuel the cars. I will pay you a premium. Just come, come fuel the cars, my man. So upgrades. Ooh, we've got the airstrip here. We've got barn level one. We need to get storage, communication center, radio tower. We also need the airstrip. This is the, the main one that we need. $250. All right. Our employee is, is still not working. Matthew, I need you to go fuel the cars, please. Okay. I just needed to talk to him in person. My goodness. I think, I mean, honestly, it's probably not a bad idea, especially if we paid him a premium. I think we should probably open up the rest of the, the fuel. The fuel's easy, right? Let's open up all fuel dispensers. When people are coming in here and buying things and asking for their car to be repaired and things like that, that's when it gets a little bit sketchy. But for now, you know what? We probably could hire one other person. I eh. I just want to leave it for now and see what happens. I, I We need to keep making money. I don't want to hire too many employees and then we don't, don't have enough to be able to make anything. Oh, are we going to choose difficulty? All right. Marshall Wands. Move the mouse. Left or right to show the plane the right way to take off. Keep the plane in the middle of the runway surrounded with lights. If the plane goes too far beyond the line, the mini game will restart. When the plane reaches the right speed and is in the runway area, a startup mission will light up. Use the LMB or space bar to give the signal to take off. Okay. So just move it left or right to show them which way. Bring it this way, sir. Come on, Joe. I can't see. I can't see him. Uh, little left. Bring her here. Oh, oh, oh. You are you are way off, my man. Okay, you're good now. You're good. You're good. You're good. Oh my goodness, that was right on top of us. But he's able to get out of there. Minigame finished successfully. And it looks like we've got a working airstrip. We've got money potentially coming in let's go ahead and clean this place up make it look presentable for future clients Ooh, i, I remember that now the trash bags fall and then you got to throw those into the thing i think we're good so that's been picked up we got our trash bag let's go throw this over in the uh the thing and it sounds like we might have somebody coming in my man's still not working I, I don't I don't know what's going on. I'm really sorry about the wait everyone I, we need to find a, a better employee I think they refresh like every um What's it called? Every few minutes on the higher screen. So this, we're looking for high fueling. I mean, he's supposedly not bad at fueling. He's back to being idle. I'm going to say clean the station and then I'm going to say fuel, fuel cars, please. Come fuel the cars. Back here, we're going to clean up some cobwebs where we can. Oh, we've got airplanes in here? Okay, I see you. Let's make sure we get all these. One more up there. Beautiful. Do we have any... Oop, uh-oh. What is this over here? Is this... The computer? Or it wants us to talk to this. Oh, that takes us back to the back of the gas station. And then this warps us back over to the thing. Okay, that's great. Wants us to buy a fixing spot next. Homeboy is still not working. I, I really don't know what to say. He's... 
He's gonna get fired. I'm sorry. Look at this. Your boy's out here running a, a dang airstrip and the customers can't even get out of the car before I'm ready to go. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Unbelievable. All right. We're, we're just gonna fire him. We're, we're gonna just leave, I guess, one pump open. You know, if I wanted to, I could fire you from the computer, but I decided to come over here to let you know, absolutely get the heck out of my face, dude. You must... You must pay me my dollar and 76 cents first. I paid you your premium. Goodbye. Your boy's feeling ruthless. I'm out here to make money. I'm, I'm not here to do anything else. So management, let's just shut this down to one at pump three. And then that way, when we're running back and forth, we can take care of it pretty quickly. So uh, let's go back. We want to go to upgrades. If we take a look at our airstrip, we want to get fixing spot level two. Shells for storing duct tape, fuel dispenser, and fuel tank. Let's go ahead and upgrade it. So we're going to be able to gas up, get some plain gas to these guys, and overall improve our uh, improve our, our product and offering here at the airstrip. So we are back. Now we've got access. Ooh, we've got a computer over here now, so that's good. We're going to be able to, what does it want us to do? It wants us to order duct tape. So we're going to order parts, products, duct tape for the airstrip. It's $29, so we're... I mean, let's, I'm imagining we're probably going to use quite a few of these. So we'll, we'll order 20 of those. I'm going to order double what they asked. I don't want to spend $500 on duct tape off the rip. Okay. So we've got some parts. Those should be coming in over time. Order aviation fuel using your PC. So we're going to go in to delivery again, fuel supply. We're going to want airport fuel. I'm going to say, let's add 200 for $400. That's been ordered, and now we need to wait for both of these to be delivered. Looks like we've already kind of got one on the way. Keep hearing planes overhead. We need to make sure people know that they can come see us. Was the, the skyline always down there before? I don't, I don't know that it was. Okay, so there's our Coyote car parts. Now that, it's going to take it over to our warehouse. But if it's in the where, do we have to take it from our warehouse? I think we do. That's annoying. I wish we could have a warehouse over here. Here comes our gas. See where he's going to end up going. Good to see you, sir. I know it's been a minute. I haven't really needed you in a long time, but uh, we have a whole new shebang happening here. So if I open... it's going to have to hook it up, I think. Come on around, sir. This is uh, the new tank. This is the new digs. What do you think, man? We really... We're, we're doing something out here. So we'll get that pumping. And then if we come back... It is kind of nice that you can just poof. We've got the warehouse over here. Been a while since we did this. We're going to have to open it up, right? Shoot, wrong way, Trev. Got to go in here. Got to open it up with the lever. Both sides are open. And then I think we need to uh, open these up. I'll take these. Is that everything? That's everything. So now what we could do is go back to our sign over here. Go back this way. And then I think we should be able to stock the shelves. JK, I think we might... Uh, oh, we put them in our warehouse back there and then we can just put the duct tape out here. Okay. I was confused. I wasn't sure how to do it. I thought we messed it up, but we're, we're good to go. Got the delivery truck getting honked at by the cops. We've got a customer over there, but I really we need to wait for a signal from Joe. In the meantime, you can check your business. All right. So we're just going to go back. Let's take care of the gas over yonder. Always good to keep things rolling over here. We want to keep making some money. Make sure that we're, I mean, we probably could open up two pumps. I don't want people to wait too long. Really, I don't think it's going to hurt anything. There's, I don't think you get like a grade or anything. I think if we just leave it open, we should be fine. More planes coming over. Come on, man. I'm trying to fix this thing up, make it look nice. We should paint on top. Like, stop here. Let's open a diner. Let's, let's do something. Curious what other sort of upgrades we're going to be able to do. We're going to be able to get uh, storage level one and two. We're going to be able to get communications headquarters, additional barn floor with airport screens, deny landing skill, first row products, radio tower with a deny skill cooldown. Okay. Not really sure what a lot of this means, but it's very expensive. So I, we're, I mean, flying is expensive. We're, we're going to have to make some money here for sure. Here's fish. I'm reporting to the aquarium. Over. How you doing, Joe? Oh, is Charlie Mike. I repeat, Charlie Mike. Over. Code ah, is it's Charlie. You. Straight to the point. Charlie you need Mike. To invest a couple of bucks in that airstrip. I've talked with some pilots, and they promise to be regulars at your place. Perfect. They'll bring you a lot of interesting stuff to trade. 
Maybe you can get me a few bottles of tequila from their deliveries. Uh, I need them for something. I'll give you something in return. Don't you think I'm some kind of a miser? Take care, partner. Okay, we want to buy a communication center HQ. Hopefully that's not going to cost too much. Only $250. I will be honest, he's kind of running through our money pretty quickly. So now we've got a comms HQ. Hopefully we're going to be able to communicate with other pilots, bring them in. Landmarks and upgrades. That's in Australia right there. Uluru, the big rock. So I'm not sure what to do. Buy a trade airstrip one spot. What does that mean? Joe's going to give us a blueprint for 10 Lobo Blanco tequilas. What does buy a trade airstrip one spot mean, though? We've got an objective down here. So next up, we're going to buy our first trade strip, which is going to cost us $250. We need to be level three. Oh, we need $250. We don't have enough money. Okay, we... we we need to we need to work the pumps a little bit. Let's make a little bit of money and we're gonna be fine. Just a budding business owner here trying to open up a new airstrip. Your your you know services are very much welcome. We need to keep the the gas station running, bringing in checks. That's honestly one of the biggest things. But I, if I can't find employees that could do it for me, then we're never gonna be able to work over there on the airstrip. So I don't know. We'll we'll see, see how it goes. How much you want, ma'am? I wouldn't mind giving you $250 worth. That that brings in a little bit there. I think two more cars, we might be okay. This chick is coming in real sketchy. She slammed on the brakes right there for no reason. You good? You feeling all right? Oh, oh, you're not good. I can now... S oh, okay, you're better now. All right. I was going to say, I can see why you almost hit something there. we got a police officer coming in to pump one. The first pump, the pump that's brought us the most money. As long as he's got 26 bucks worth of gas, we should should be able to make this work. Come on, sir. Good to see you. Thank you for your, your service. Thank you for your business. Really appreciate it. And bam, there it is. You can kind of cheat towards the other end. If you spend, you know, you let it go a little bit far, then you can sell a little bit more to him. So I think now by buying this first trade strip, there's a snake over here. I don't see see them though and it I, I really hated those those scared me so much okay so we're gonna come into our um our upgrades airstrip trade script second fuel dispenser unlocks cargoes from foreign countries in mexico canada brazil colombia argentina cuba uruguay venezuela bolivia and puerto rico sounds good to me i'm in but now we're gonna have to fill the second fuel pump which is well actually i think all the fuel pumps run off the same tank, so that's that's good. So we've got two spots now. We're going to have to clear these, though. Use tow to remove the wrecks out of the airstrip. You can put the wrecks in the large container or just put them outside of the area. Well, come on, Toey. Let's go. Ooh. We're kind of a little, a little extended on this thing. We're fine, though. Bring them on around. Back them on up. Go ahead and hit that. Bring this over here. Can we activate that? Got him. You don't got to be perfect. So now we can bring this guy over here. And we have to remember we are going to have to have to fuel Toei up over time. Watch out for the telephone pole. I'm just going to throw him in our thing. I can hear that snake still. I'm going to throw him in our dumpster because I don't like the idea of having a lot of stuff lying around. Let's go ahead and bring him up. Bring him over this way. Is that close enough? Not really. We're going to have to back this thing up all the way to the back. Toei's, uh, his ability to, to move isn't as, as nice as I would like it to be. I mean, that's got to be close enough, right? Whatever. Second one here. Let's go ahead and pick him up. Drop it down low. Got him. feel like the days and nights fly by here, man. Got three cars over at the fuel pump, so we're going to want to go take care of that stat. I would imagine, I mean, aviation fuel is fairly expensive, but I feel like it's really not that bad. So I don't know how much more money we're going to be making. I, I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Bring this guy around here. Not too shabby. Nice job, Toei. All right. I'm just, uh, I'm just going to get out and we can reset you with this button right here. Good to see you in there, sir. Although I think that's part of our problem. I think we got to, we got to bring this thing all the way in, all the way down all the way back 
and then we're we're good to leave them overnight. What do we got going on, sir? You've arrived at your command post. Here's the list of upcoming Argentina arrivals. and Mexico. On the left, you can see the plane's country of origin. Its number, cargo, and time to arrival. Cargo is divided into two categories. The top row is what the pilot is carrying, and the bottom row is what he wants to trade for. Depending on your communication center level, you'll be able to identify more products from the list before the pilot arrives. Do you remember what I asked for? Doesn't look like the next pilot is carrying tequila. You can reject the plane using the X button on the right side of the screen. Ah, okay. I don't want you. I don't want your kind here. Discard him. Fast learner, partner. This guy now wants Bally's for tequila. Device. I'll show you one more thing. Okay. So we've got a communication yeah, device here. Almost the same. Ah. The device shows only two upcoming flights, not four like on the screen. So we yes, can see this at any moment. moment. You can see information about the goods I'm currently interested in. You can give them to me every time I arrive at the airport and expect a fair reward. So Simple for 10 bottles that. of tequila, we're well, going to get the blueprint. Check if you're prepared for your first trade. Remember that anything you want to trade with must be in your warehouse, not on the shelves. One more thing. Remember that all pilots need some refueling after the long journey. Always do it before you start trading with them. There may not be enough time for that later. If you do everything right, they'll trust you more. Fox 29 out. Interesting. So we want to make sure we fuel them up first and then do your trading. You got to make sure you have the items that you need for trading in your warehouse. And to be honest, I think we're going to be good on that front. We have a pretty stocked warehouse and we haven't had the gas station open for merch sales and and you know other actual physical items so we should we should be looking pretty good here so we just need to wait i'm assuming the trade does it matter which one he's going to land on is he going to land here for trading i'm not sure order products desired by the pilot without products in the warehouse you won't be able to trade i think we're good i really do so he's going to be he's on the way he's arriving already okay is that him no i hear something Oh boy, appeared out of nowhere. Ah! And we're probably gonna have to lead him out too, right? Oh, he's, he's, oh, okay. I was gonna say he's not doing well. He is, appears to be smoking, but he's just backing this thing on in there. Like a boss. All right, so we're gonna grab our av, av gas here. You're an expert. A little bit fast on the av gas. Now on the plane, we press F to interact. Welcome to the trading tutorial. Here you'll learn steps uh, to take on a way to successfully exchange products. At the top, you can see a timer. It shows the remaining time for the trade. The time is over. The pilot will immediately leave the airstrip. On the right side, you can see all the products that are in the pilot's cargo. You can always pick as many projects as you are interested in. Pick the tequila at the trade space. Okay. Trade space is the space where all products selected, yada, yada. Uh, you can end the negotiations with the deny button or typically suspend them with the hold button. However, for tutorial purposes, those actions are locked for now. Now you can select how many bottles of tequila that you want to get. I'm going to say select at least 10. I, I want 20. Now select the products from your side. If your product is great, it means it's not available in your warehouse. So we could do these. Syndicator shows the current chances for successful exchange. You could affect them by mixing products in the trade space. Selecting the trade button will result in offering a trade to the pilot. He can reject or accept it. As no offer has a 100% chance of success, select it now to see what happens. I would like m more. And I'm... I'm, I'm going to offer you one for 60 I'm bottles kidding. of tequila. I'm waiting for a serious offer. I feel that. After the offer rejection, the impatience indicator fills up, depending on the relevance of the offer. When the indicator reaches an end, the pilot leaves the airstrip. Here's some special skills you can use while trading. Each skill has a cooldown, so choose wisely. Use the available skill, the power of calm, to reduce the impatience indicator when increased due to the rejected offer. Okay, and it looks like it's got a 12-minute cooldown. Interest. This is weird. Try to increase the number of products offered to convince the pilot to trade. And try to propose a trade again. Remember that every next offer after rejection has to be higher. So he's not going to do 40 for 40. I'm going to try 40 for 30. Is there anything else we can use? I don't think we can use any. Agreed. Yes, let's go. All right, we got 30 bottles of tequila for 40 packs of candy. I think that's a pretty dang good 
good trade. Dude flew all the way from Mexico to make that trade with us. That is what I'm talking about. Dude, this is this is fun. I like this. There's kind of like a, a little bit of randomness to it. We've got some perks we've got to activate. We gotta keep making sure we're making money, otherwise we're gonna get ourselves in a bad spot. We're gonna have to continuously refill our inventory and, and order more things. We're gonna have to continuously refill the gas on each side, both this side and the other side. We can see we've got 177 liters in the uh, the gas station, 158 at the airport. It appeared that the airport gas. The, uh, the Avgas didn't really fetch any more than you would normally expect. So, that's unfortunate, but it sounds like Joe's going to be coming back in. I kind of want to figure out a way to make... Is there a way to make this daytime all the time? I feel like it's, it's very, very dark. It's coming in. I can hear him. Come on in, Joe! Let's go, Joe! Where's he coming in at? Right here. I want to see a plane land in, in the daytime. Looks like these things just smoke a lot no matter what you do. At least we're not rescuing him with, with Toei and having to drag him in and duct tape him up. Looks like he fared a little bit better this time. We get some more lights in here? Bro, it is so dark. I, I don't understand. Why, why are we... Joe, why are we working in the dark, sir? Oh, this isn't... Is this... This isn't Joe. Let me get you some gas here, sir. Ooh. You're an expert. The, the gas works weird. Okay. Um, I mean, right now, I think all we want is tequila, right? Hold the trade. Let me take a look at this. He just wants tequila. So I, I, I think we're, I think we're good. He's got a Mayan calendar. He's got tribal art. He's got all kinds of stuff that we can't. Oh, you could put like, pilot a lot, pilot lost part of the cargo on the way due to the small amount of products or value can be higher. Interesting. Like, could we could we put this Mexican beer? I, I, I don't know if that's that's probably not a Mexican beer. Well, quinoa cerveza, Valle quinoa. Could we put that in on the shelves of our gas station and then, you know, make more from it overall? What? Something. Joe crashed. Is this going to become a thing, Joe? Because I'm not really interested in constantly going out and picking you up. If you don't know how to fly the plane, just stay here. Help me work the, the thing. Dude, he is, is way out here. Make sure we're cooling down our engines as we go. You know, the first time I thought it was an accident, Joe. I, I thought I was just helping out a man in need. It's not letting me cool him down. There we go. But I'm beginning to think that you're a bit more of an issue than than we originally thought. I have no idea how it happened. Damn Joe, you see now, old man. Did it much better in the old days. Nah, never mind. I need a drink. I I think but that's the opposite of what you need, sir. All right, we got him, and we're gonna try to get him out of here. Old Toey can always be counted on. Let's go. The angles that you get here are pretty cool. Joe's shipping Monday through Friday. Well, I don't, I don't know how much he... Ooh, oh, what's up, Joe? I'm inside your fuselage. Um, I don't know how much he ships. Oh, we got a plane coming in. Oh, Joe, watch out, Joe. Joe, 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 Joe. All right, we're good. Woo. That could have been really bad right there. Okay, switch back, drop him off. We're going to be good to go. Let's go ahead and... Reset Toei. And look at this, man. We got a couple of airplanes in here. Your boy is getting it done. Now I see what we've got going on, Joe. Because every time you come here, you need some help with your uh, your duct tape. And it appears that you're just not a very good good pilot, my man. I, I, hate, to, I hate to talk about you. But it's just kind of a, a fact of the matter. I kind of like the duct tape. All right. Oh, I see you're prepared this time. That's pretty damn impressive. Since you already have a dispenser, I could use some refueling too. I like how he's... He partially used tape out of the shelf, so we're just gonna put that down right there. I like how he's talking talking crap about us. Like, of course I'm prepared. I've been more prepared than you've been. I don't regret working with you for one bit. 
Now, throw my order in the trunk of my plane and you'll get something special. Okay. Interact there. So we're going to trade him 10 tequilas for a blueprint. Oh, I thought we were going to be able to do that numerous times. That's why I got all the tequila. Special landmarks. I'm always happy to provide it. But as I said, you must give me something in return. Gotta go. Will you help me during the takeoff? We got another plane over here. I'll help you out in a second, Joe. Let's go ahead and fill him up. Perfect. Now we're going to come back over here. We're going to have to do this mini game. I'm going to go hard again. Plane is building up speed. Not going to lie. It's kind of hard to see from all the way back here. Keep her straight. Left. A little left, a little more left, a little right. Come on, Joe. Again, like I said, enough, enough drinking on the job, my man. Left. Not too shabby. See you later, buddy. Now his next thing, he wants Dragomeister Likord. Let's see what you have here. Any Dragomeister? Nope. No. Ooh, a building blueprint? Pilot. I mean, I might try that. Oh. Trade failed. He left. I didn't give him enough time. Sorry, man. I wasn't really paying attention, if you want me to be honest. It's all right. So if we look up here, we can see it on our little radio, but we can see more up here. So this one's on the way. He... I mean, we can't see everything he has. We're going to have to upgrade our communication center to be able to see all the things so far all we can see is just a blueprint and one in each so anyway this is uh this is really good man i'm really enjoying myself so far i hope you guys are too i'm gonna see you guys in episode two of our new dlc here in gas station simulator hopefully to keep on grinding keep on doing our thing and i'll see you guys there drop a like if you guys enjoyed thank you guys so much for watching peace out